Hello everyone and welcome to my channel, Advice to Think Twice. My name is Monica and I'm here with your bi-weekly readings for the second half of February 2016. So the week's starting February 15th and February 22nd, 2016. Um, this reading is for Capricorn. So please bear in mind that these are general readings and so they may not apply to everybody or not um, in the same way. And please take the messages that resonate with you and also please check your moon and rising sign readings as well um, for some extra clarification, extra messages. Um, also, if I'm not covering your specific situation or your specific example of what you're going through, um, please just take the energy of the cards okay, that I'm talking about and apply them to your situation okay with these being this is general readings I'm not going to be able to cover every angle every single possible example okay so just um, just keep that in mind um, so Capricorn the decks that I'm using are the wheel of the year tarot los carabeo tarot and then advice cards are coming from the angel tarot cards and the Wild Wisdom of the Fairy Oracle deck. Okay, so Capricorn, the main energies for you. We have quite a few major arcana cards in here, so uh, there's some big changes happening. So overall energy for this two-week period, we have the Hangman, and we have the, the Hierophant. Okay, so... The hangman is about new perspectives, okay, opening your eyes to something, seeing the, the truth in a situation. The hierophant is all about uh, tradition, morality, dignity, doing things the right way, doing the right things. Um, so it's like your eyes are being opened to a truth of a situation or you're gaining a new perspective by letting go of the outcome you desire okay you're allowing for the outcome to be whatever it is and so that brings you a new perspective that brings you a new way of seeing things um, for some of you if you've been feeling lost this is the week when you find your faith again you find your strength again your purpose in life and for others this is telling me that you are waiting for something to evolve you're waiting for something to move to the next level to move to a higher level okay so this can also be stepping out of a situation or it can be like I said waiting or it can be delays okay um, it's like some more time needs to pass until the Hierophant energy can come in taking things to the next level okay it can be that as well um, and it can be that you find yourself in a group of people this week that you haven't um, interacted with before And these are like-minded people, okay? So if you're waiting on answers or you're waiting on solutions, then a group of people or like a, like a club or like a team um, may play a significant part in helping you get there, helping you get the answers that you're looking for. Okay? For others, this is simply a time when you're focused more on your spirituality and on your faith, okay, whatever that may be, and you are counting on your faith to give you answers, to give you solutions, okay, so you're allowing for your God, your angels, your spirit guides, the universe to speak to you, okay, you are opening your mind to new solutions that may come to you through your intuition okay um, career and finances we have the emperor and we also have the lovers 
Okay, so so when it comes to career finances, your job, the way you make your money, there are some changes happening, okay? Or you are waiting for some changes to happen. Um, the Emperor card and the Hierophant card stand for figures of authority, okay? So you may have had conversations or negotiations with your bosses, with your superiors. You may have asked for a raise. You may have asked for a change of job. You may have asked to be transferred. You may have had these discussions with a representative of a different company that you're, you're current than the one you're currently employed by, okay, because you want to change your job. And you've had the conversations. You've made the choice to go there, okay, you've gone through all the negotiations you're just waiting to hear back from them okay you're waiting for everything to be put in order so that you can leave this job and go on to the other one or you're waiting for legal paperwork to go through to um, certify to validate your new position or your new salary or your new job description or your new career or project or contract Okay, because the emperor, like I said, this is a figure of authority. This is a boss figure. Okay, and then we have the lovers that stands for a choice or um, so it's choosing between two contracts or choosing between two jobs or choosing between two careers or two companies. Okay, and um, the lovers is basically telling you to make choices from the heart okay it's telling you to stay true to yourself and make the choice that feels right to you and then have faith that things will work out and allow for things to unfold in their own time okay so um, the lovers with the Emperor card is telling me that Either a new company is offering you a job and you're considering it and you're having conversations back and forth with either your current boss and your potential new boss, trying to get the best solution out of it, trying to um, decide which job you want to stay in or which job you want to take. Okay, it can be that as well. It can also be within the same company you want to move up or your superiors are talking to you about moving up they're asking you if you'd like to move to a managerial position to a supervisor position to a trainer trainer's position um, like or a project manager or team leader or anything of the sort okay where you would be a figure of authority okay you would would be overlooking um, and supervising a team of people and you've had some conversations back and forth you've had some negotiations or you're going through negotiations and you are just waiting to see what happens okay you're waiting to see what they come up with but it's looking pretty good okay it's looking like no matter what you choose as long as you make that decision um, from a place of integrity and staying true to yourself then no matter what you choose you will be successful okay and this is a turning point in turning point in your career okay because if you put all these cards together you have all major arcana cards okay so really take the time to go through the details and make the right decision for you okay take your time don't allow people to rush you okay this decision is important home and family life we have the eight of wands and the ten of pentacles so in your home and family life, and this includes um, immediate family, extended family, and um, close friends or people you trust, there is some unexpected news, but the news is very positive, okay? Because the Eight of Wands stands for quick communication, unexpe unexpected communication, sudden changes, um, things that you did not see coming okay things are happening things are moving really really quickly with the eight of wands and then the ten of pentacles is a card of celebration it's a card of getting together with the family celebrating an achievement ce celebrating some kind of 
um, award or accomplishment okay and this is either a family event a family accomplishment if you will something very positive happening in the family or the family getting together to celebrate your accomplishment or the family getting together to celebrate someone else's accomplishment okay um, this is also talking about very good news coming in for you that allows this good news and this new this opportunity or this change this sudden unexpected change is now allowing you to feel stable and secure especially when it comes to finances okay so your financial situation is not going to be going up and down anymore it will be um, solid it will be balanced and it will be increasing okay so like I said whatever's going on in your career it's a big decision so take your time and and make the right decision make the right choice for you okay and I'm, I'm guessing that as a result of that it also ties in with the cars that you have for home and family because you have this news that comes in unexpectedly okay because you're waiting maybe you're prepared to wait a while for it to come through and with the eight of wands it comes through through a lot quicker than you you were anticipating and so it kind of throws you off a little bit but it is ultimately a celebration within the family alternatively this can be news of someone getting married okay this could be news of someone expecting and again no one no, uh, no one sees this coming so it's all very um, a very big surprise okay but again it's a very positive surprise this could also be people moving in together or people coming to meet the family for the first time and it's a calm laid-back occasion okay but it's going through the steps is doing things the right way okay so you need to meet the family first then you you need to build a relationship with the family and then from there you you move things to the next level okay it's important that you have their blessing if you will that they like you that they welcome you but it's a really good time in the family okay it's a really beautiful celebration this unexpected surprising news that is very positive is coming in for you and it is very much a cause for celebration because it will bring stability security to you your family or those around you okay so definitely enjoy it definitely celebrate it this also may have something to do with the way you do things in your family what your family tradition is and so you're just following those steps when bringing someone into the family or presenting someone to the family it can be that as well love life and romantic um, relationships we have the moon and we also have the two of pentacles okay so with the moon and two of pentacles in your love life your romantic relationships this is talking about a period of reflection it may be that someone asks you to marry them and he needs to take some time off to reflect on what that means for you what that would do to your life how your life would change how your future would look if you're happy with that this could also be someone is presenting you with a choice or you have to choose between two people that are coming in and it's really it's really important that you take the time out you detach yourself from the situation in order to have a clear mind and reflect on what you think what you feel because this is a big step this is a big deal okay so the choice that you make now will influence your future in the long term okay because if you look at it this snake biting its, t its tail um, is forming the infinity symbol okay so it is long-term consequences okay long-term influence for those of you who are already in a relationship this is also 
a time when you look at the relationship, okay? You reflect on memories, good and bad, how far you've come, how you still feel about each other, okay? This could be a time of romance, a time of uh, falling in love again, and you're looking at your future and what you want to do next, how you want to move forward. You may have two choices ahead of you that you need to decide between, uh, for example, either if you start a family now or if you give it a couple of years and you focus on your career or if you buy this house or you buy this house or if whatever if if you both go to work or if one of you stays home or uh, if you want to have a family what the dynamic would be okay so it's a time of looking at the possibilities of your relationship okay um, and you're looking at things for the long run again okay and this is important because this is the time when you start to create your own family values and your own traditions okay moving forward okay what else For others of you, you are holding out for maybe a marriage proposal. There's something about a marriage proposal that you're really thinking about, you're really waiting on, you've been waiting on this for a while. And it's like you need to have that in order for things to be balanced again. Okay, so you're really, really waiting. Either you want to propose and you're waiting for the right time, or you're really waiting for your partner to propose and you're not sure when that is, and you feel like you've been waiting for a while and it's really starting to stress you out a little bit. Okay, in which case I would say take a deep breath, okay, detach yourself from the situation, allow for things to happen in their own time, okay, allow for things to unfold naturally. And it will happen for you when it is meant to happen for you, okay? So just don't stress about it. Don't get afraid. Don't get overwhelmed. Okay? It's, it's going to be okay. It will work out for you. Advice cards. We have the King of Earth. Okay, and this is a really good card. The King of Earth, Earth is about a successful time. Confidently accept opportunities you are offered the Midas touch. Okay, so whatever you touch turns to gold. So this is a very successful time for you. Okay, so it really ties in with your career. Confidently accept opportunities that you are offered. So offers definitely are coming in for your career and as well in your love life. And so if it feels right, then definitely go for it. Okay, but listen to your intuition get in touch with your inner voice okay and really stay grounded and balanced and level-headed when you're considering the possibilities okay but it's a really prosperous time for you during this time so um, everything is blooming around you everything is flourishing around you okay so definitely use this energy second advice card we have we have the silver sisters and this is talking about a time to take protection from toxic thoughts and energy okay so I feel like this ties in especially in your romantic situation okay with the moon card because the moon card can be about your doubts and fears and about the shadow side okay um, so if things are not happening exactly the way you thought they would be by now don't doubt yourself don't doubt your partner don't doubt the people around you okay things will happen happen for you when they are meant to happen for you you need to be patient and have faith that everything will work out for you okay because with the king of earth everything is working out for you okay it's a very prosperous time you need to be patient and allow for things to grow in their own rhythm in their own time okay because they are growing things are happening for you things are changing for you things are coming in very positive things are coming in for you 
a lot of security, a lot of stability, a lot of success, and even romance, okay? So don't allow yourself to get doubtful or afraid, okay? Or um, question yourself or question the people around you, okay? To try to force something to happen, okay? That's not a good idea. So um, again, stay calm, stay balanced, stay grounded, okay? Focus on the here and now. And again, make choices from the heart. Make choices that feel right to you, okay? Because you will be inspired at this time. You will be connected to your spirituality at this time. So listen to the messages you receive through your intuition. Okay, but other than that, it looks like a really good time for you. Um, you're going to have to let me know if the cards apply to you and how they apply to your particular situation. Um, please like, share and subscribe also, okay? Um, and I hope you have a great time ahead of you. And I'll talk to you soon. Take care.